गुड मॉर्निंग ऑल टूडे वी विल सॉल्व अ न्यूमेरिकल क्वेश्चन ऑन कन्वोल्यूशन ऑपरेशन इन दिस क्वेश्चन वी विल परफॉर्म द कन्वोल्यूशन ऑपरेशन यूजिंग दिस थ्री क्रॉस थ्री मास्क ऑन दिस साइडेड पिक्सल्स ऑफ फाइव क्रॉस फाइव इमेज एंड वी हैव टू डिटरमाइन वॉट इज द आउटपुट पिक्सल वैल्यू फॉर दिस साइडेड पिक्सल्स आफ्टर परफॉर्मिंग द कन्वोल्यूशन ऑपरेशन सो इन ऑर्डर टू प्रोसीड इन दिस क्वेश्चन दिस इज माई इनपुट इमेज and this is the mask which is given to us now in order to proceed the convolution process this mask we have to rotate it by 180 degree so in order to achieve the total 180 degree rotation first we will rotate this mask by 90 degree and our direction of rotation it it is anti clockwise direction rotating this plane by 90 degree in anti clockwise direction it means this first row it becomes the first column this second row it becomes the second column and this third row it becomes the third column now in order to achieve total 180 degree of rotation again this mask we will rotate it by 90 degree in anti clockwise direction now if you rotate this mask by 90 degree in anti clockwise direction it means this first row it becomes the first column this second row it becomes the second column and this third row it becomes the third column now this is my mask w after rotating 180 degree in convolution operation the given mask we have to rotate it first by total 180 degree and now we have to identify the center of this rotated mask the center of this rotated mask it is 1 by 3 so this center of this mask we will place in our desired sided pixels value and we will perform the, the convolution operation so first we will perform for pixel value 50 that is for this pixel we will perform so if you place the center of this mask that is 1 by 3 at 50 and if we perform the bit wise multiplication it means this 30 will be multiplied with this 0 plus this pixel value 40 will be multiplied with this coefficient 1 by 6 next pixel value 50 will be multiplied with this coefficient 0 plus pixel value 40 will be multiplied with this coefficient 1 by 6 similarly pixel value 50 will be multiplied with this coefficient 1 by 3 next pixel value 80 will be multiplied with this coefficient 1 by 6 similarly in the next row pixel value 35 will be multiplied with this coefficient 0 pixel value 255 will be multiplied with this coefficient 1 by 6 and pixel value 70 will be multiplied with this coefficient 0 if you simplify this expression this expression becomes 
फिफ्टी मल्टीप्लाइड विथ वन बाय थ्री प्लस वन बाय सिक्स मल्टीप्लाइड विथ फोर्टी प्लस फोर्टी प्लस एटी प्लस टू फिफ्टी फाइव विच ऑन सिंप्लीफिकेशन अप टू टू डेसिमल प्लेस इट इज एटी फाइव पॉइंट एट थ्री नाउ अगेन सिंस इट्स अ फ्लोटिंग पॉइंट नंबर सो फ्लोटिंग पॉइंट नंबर वी विल राउंड ऑफ टू इट्स नियरेस्ट इंटीजर इट मीन्स एटी फाइव पॉइंट एट थ्री इट्स नियरेस्ट इंटीजर नंबर इट इज एटी सिक्स सो इन द आउटपुट इमेज एट पिक्सल वैल्यू फिफ्टी at this pixel location the new pixel value we will assign after performing the convolution operation it is 86 next we will perform for this pixel value 80 so now i will write the rotated mass after 180 degree of rotation it is 0 1 by 6 0 now for pixel value 80 the center of this mass that is 1 by 3 the center of this mass 1 by 3 we will place at 80 and we will perform the bit wise multiplication bit wise multiplication it means this 40 now it will be multiplied with this coefficient 0 pixel value 50 will be multiplied with this coefficient 1 by 6 pixel value 70 will be multiplied with this coefficient 0 in the next row pixel value 50 will be multiplied with this coefficient 1 by 6 pixel value 80 will be multiplied with this coefficient 1 by 3 similarly next pixel value 60 will be multiplied with this coefficient 1 by 6 Similarly in the next row pixel value 255 will be multiplied with this coefficient 0 pixel value 70 will be multiplied with this coefficient 1 by 6 and finally pixel value 0 will be multiplied with this coefficient 0 again we will simplify this expression 80 multiplied with 1 by 3 plus 1 by 6 terms 50 plus 50 plus 60 plus 70 which on simplification it will give you the value 65 next we will determine for the pixel value 60 so next we will determine for the pixel value 60 again the center of this mask that is 1 by 3 we will place at 60 and we will perform the bit wise multiplication
So if we place the center of this mask 1 by 3 at 60 and if we perform the bitwise multiplication, this pixel value 50 will be multiplied with this coefficient 0. Similarly, this pixel value 70 will be multiplied with this coefficient 1 by 6. Plus, this pixel value 90 will be multiplied with this coefficient 0. Plus, in the next row, this pixel value 80 will be multiplied with this coefficient 1 by 6. Similarly, this pixel value 60 will be multiplied with this coefficient 1 by 3. Next, this pixel value 100 will be multiplied with this coefficient 1 by 6. Plus, in, similarly in the next row, this pixel value 70 will be multiplied with this coefficient 0. Plus, this pixel value 0 will be multiplied with this coefficient 1 by 6. And this pixel value 120 will be multiplied with this coefficient 0. Now we will simplify this. It is 60 multiplied with 1 by 3 plus 1 by 6 multiplied with 70 plus 80 plus 100 plus this 0. which on simplification up to two decimal place it is 61.67 now 61.67 it's a floating point number so we will round off this number to its nearest integer so it becomes equals to 62 now in order to draw the output of the image we have to check what is the dimension of the input image since the dimension of the input image it is 5 cross 5 so in order to draw the output of the image, we will draw a 5 cross 5 output image. Now at pixel value 50, we obtain our filter image output, it is 86. So in the output image, here I will write 86. For pixel value 80, we have obtained our filter image output, it is 65. So in the output image, in place of 80, I will write here 65. And for the pixel value 60, we have obtained the filter image output, it is 62. So in the output image, in place of 60, I will write 62. And with this, this question is over. Thank you.